feels like a good selfie. Sure, you can do it on your own, but if you really want to crush it, you have to surround yourself with your best friends. These are mine. Imogen. We're next door neighbors, and this is her first year of public school. She's adjusting. Courtney, my brother's girlfriend. She shouldn't even be here. She graduated last year, but can't seem to stay away. Dakota, his advice is top notch and he's the gayest straight shooter at Brayer. And Andy, me, just trying to land a boyfriend before I graduate. This is my foursome, the non-sexual kind. Umbrella. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to scare you, little sis. The only thing that scares me is your hyper focus on my relationship status. I swear to God, if it even reads, it's complicated. Babe. Mm. Ew. Mm. not related. Andy, I've been dating your brother like forever and I've known you since braces. We're basically blood twins. I don't even know what that means. Andy, the top looks a little uh, low cut, don't you think? It looks like you're asking for it. I am asking for it, Alec. What? Babe, she looks adorable. Okay, just leave her alone. No, no Alec, really. what are you doing? Like this. All the staple Stop. removers removed. Alec. <laughs> it's because he cares. Good luck, kiddo. Kiddo. Got it. Camel toe epidemic. Are high-waisted pants really to blame? What do you think? Think this would be a good segment for our show? Wait, 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 wait. I know I've only been in school for one month, but there's already an epidemic. Okay, 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 okay. Where do I find the camel toe pamphlets? In the nurses, I will go get one. <laughs> Take it easy, homeschooled. Camel toes are contagious. <gasps> Although... Your pants are back to differ. Oh my God. Well, I'm totally sisters owned. MG, what are these guys? With my guys, pants? guys, guys. Alec has made it like completely impossible for me to get any play until I graduate. You know what was happening to me when I was walking down the hallway today? I was giving DSEs to like every single guy I saw, and they all District looked at state me. elections. No, no, no. Google it, homeschooled. It's like Alec thinks it's his responsibility to protect me ever since our dad left, which. Unfortunately for me, it means invoking the bro code. You know, like, bros before hoes, except I'll never be a hoe because of my bro, and I'm gonna die a virgin. Actually, my mom says that hoes are also garden tools, so if somebody ever calls you that, you can be like, oh, well, thank you for appreciating my green thumb. Mm. Andy, I'm sorry, I really can't with this one. I really Dakota. can't. Dakota. I, I can't, I can't. Dakota, Imogen is <sighs> one of us now. She's one of our oldest friends, and I promised her mom I'd look out for her. Back to the real issue, I'm sister zoned, and did I even mention that Alec totally embarrassed me in front of Josh today? Honey, how many times are we gonna have this discussion? All right, Josh is a Furby in an arcade claw machine. You have to get through some of those whack, disgusting, irrelevant stuffed animals before you can get that Furby. Yes, and plus, he's Alec's best friend. I mean, how would you feel if somebody tried to date me? Imogen, it's not the same thing. I'm dating. No, no, not the same thing. Andy, look. All right, so Josh and Alec aren't really the problem. The problem is you. I mean, you go full lemon face around the male species. It's not my fault. Josh is the only guy that Alec lets me talk to, and I can barely form a sentence around him. He's just so cute, and he's different than Alec's other friends. Josh is just so... Josh is what? Giving me a ride home from, from band camp. From band camp, yeah. Band, band, band camp. camp. Yeah. You don't play an instrument. I know, that's why I need band camp. Cool. By the way, does it mean going to college mean you occasionally have to attend class? Actually, that's the opposite of what being in college means. The 
besides, you guys, we're a foursome. If I was always in class, we wouldn't be a foursome anymore. We'd be like a threesome and a onesome. Uh, uh, hey, hey, Courtney. Yeah, we were a foursome, but you know, people get older, you know, things change, and you know, older people go away to college. No, no, older people maintain their friendships because it helps with longevity. No, we're talking about how your switch boyfriend is making it impossible for Andy to land a date. Don't blame Alex, okay? If Andy wants to cruise, she needs to become forbidden fruit. You know, like a like a star fruit or a kiwi or a jackfruit. Mm -hmm. Like Adam and Eve's fruit. Light bulb! Andy, we will get a college guy to come to prayer and pretend to be your boyfriend. And then bam! All the boys of Brer are now noticing you as someone else's property. Come on, let's see what we're working with here. Okay, we definitely need to show some more. No. Tete! -te. No. Put those babies up. Oh, 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 uh, I'm sorry. I would say I should have not, but this is my classroom. Andy, what gives? I gave you the keys to the media room for Cup of Brer. Did, did I make a mistake? No, Mr. Shaw, we were just editing a segment together. La, 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 la. I don't need to hear the details, all right? What I do need is for you all not to ditch class and then come and hang out in here because it comes back to me. Uh, Steve? Dakota, I've asked you repeatedly, don't call me Steve. <coughs> Courtney, come on, you know the drill. But Mr. Shaw, these are my friends. If you don't go to school here, you can't hang out here. Mm hmm You know who else hangs around schools they don't attend? <laughs> Pedophiles. <laughs> Hey, what's up? Hey. I texted you at noon and never heard back. Oh, uh, baby, I was in school. <laughs> right. <laughs> Duh. Uh. <laughs> it's just, you posted this pic of you and two freshman butterfaces. Oh, right. Right, right, right. Yeah, um, Mrs. Patel was totally on my nuts. She took my phone. That is so annoying. Yeah, it's annoying. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to make sure I'm getting this right. Mrs. Patel posted your pic, and Mrs. Patel captioned it, me and my main hose? You know, Court, I leave 10 minutes before practice, baby, and, and I chose to spend this time with you. You know, I want to make it special. I know, babe. It's just I feel like I'm telling you something, and you're not really listening to what I'm saying. You know what, Courtney? Did your IUD release an extra dose of estrogen because you're being crazy? That happened twice, and you promised you wouldn't bring it up again. I can't deal with this right now, Court. I gotta go to practice. I can... what? I, you don't get to pick when we're done talking, babe. I have more to say. I love you, babe. It's cool, everybody. We're cool. Hey. Hey, hey. hey just, just don't. Okay, just don't. Just don't press the door when I'm doing it. Just, just stop. No. Just if you just don't pull the door, just one second. Take your hand off the knob. Okay, cool. God, your brother is being such a chode. I'm busy. I don't have to spend all my time at prayer, you know? But but men have needs. I'm basically his genie. I made an exception for your brother because I developed, like, hella early, and I cougared it for him because I thought he hey, could be the Courtney, one, and I... I'm sorry, sorry, but are you taking me home now? No. Remember? Big boyfriend. No, 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 Courtney, no, 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 I don't want to record it. This is both important and fun. It's on, like, Donkey Kong. Are you sure they're gonna show? Stop fidgeting. They're Beta Delta Psi pledges. Of course they're gonna show. They totally owe me. Why? <laughs> Let's just say they don't let virgins rush. <laughs> pledges, good evening. Thank you all so much for being here with us tonight. Hello, Courtney. Courtney. Hello, Courtney. Our big brothers told us if we didn't come, we'd get paddled. That's true. Gentlemen, it has been an incredible two minutes here in my dorm room. But I only have one rose to hand out. After this, all but one of you will be going home. I wish you all the best. And without further ado, here's Andy. I'm here today to... Louder, Andy. I'm here today to pick one of you to be my fake boyfriend. Uh, even though we're playing your fake boyfriend, you gonna us for real, right? Bachelor number three. Blondes. As my fake boyfriend, you'll be kissing me on the mouth. I mean, I mean, we'll, we'll have a kiss. Share, share a kiss. <laughs> Bachelor number two. What do you do to prep before a kiss? I like to fluff my stuff, 
so that when I lean up against you, you can really feel what I'm packing. Oh, that's thoughtful. Do you even go here? No, I'm a townie. But I can get you guys beer. Bachelor number two, get! Yeah, I'm going, Gee. Courtney, who are these guys? Does everyone act like this? Because I'm not ready for this. You need to ask them something sexy. Okay, uh, sexy, okay. Boxers or briefs? Boxers. Briefs. Commando. Oh my god, okay. Will the three bachelors who just dropped their pants please get out of here? And now, for the final rose. Andy, when you're ready, select your suitor. It's uh, pretty much just me, so makes it easy. Yeah, so bachelor number one, Eric, before you accept this rose, we're gonna be kissing in front of a lot of people, so I need to know I can trust you. Okay, I will see you tomorrow, girlfriend. Andy, I cannot believe you're gonna kiss a complete stranger. I mean, what about cold source? What if Alex sees him kiss you? Oh my God, he's gonna kill him. Thanks for your concern, Imogen, but Courtney promised this would get me out of the sister zone, so if you could please stop talking about mouth herpes and homicide, I'd really appreciate it. Who's that? So mature. I wouldn't kick him out of bed for eating biscuits. This is my girlfriend. Whoa. I can't believe that actually worked. Oh. Oh. Alec! Get off, Alex! She's just a kid, you perv! Oh my god, Alec, get off of him! This was not worth it! Hey, that's my sister you're talking about! What's going on? Just my brother, ruining my life. Mmm, yeah, I saw. Here's a helpful hint. Maybe don't make out with guys in school? I'm just joking, kiddo. I'm seriously in a worse situation now than when we started. Now, every guy will know what will happen to them if they come near me, and that was just for a kiss. Imagine second base. I try not to. I saw my mom get a mammogram once, and it basically scarred me for life. OK. Guys, be honest. I'm not totally unfortunate looking, right? I mean. I have highlights, and I, I think I look pretty good in jeans, and I'm a classy amount of easy, and i Andy, I'm... I think I have something that's gonna help. Who? Uh, phone number. Our credit card. <gasps> Are we gonna go shopping, you guys? We might go shopping! Andy, choose a color. Green? G-R-E-E-N. Pick a number. Four. One, two, three, four. Okay, Andy. Pick one. No, sorry, Andy. Well, that was helpful. Actually, you know what, you guys? I think the cootie catcher's premonition is for the best because 98% of high school relationships end in a messy breakup or teen pregnancy. Thanks for trying, Imogen, but I'm gonna go home now and accept the fact that until I graduate, I'm wearing a chastity belt that only my brother has the key to. I know that sounded gross. Do either of you guys want to know your future? No. Alec. Alec. Alec's in this too. Okay, He's in girl. every single picture. Andy, are you still stalking Josh? Maybe. <sighs> Andy, look, I know you've had a real poodle of a week, but I'm not going to let you give up on a mess that is dating in high school. I mean, every girl deserves at least a chance. Dakota, I'm tired. I don't want to play anymore. You haven't even asked me if I had a plan to fix your whole situation. Not interested. Wow, and I thought we were the closest. <sighs> what do you have in mind? All right, I'll need an hour, and uh, yeah, you'll definitely need to shave.
All right, Andy, let's do this. Let's make love to the camera. Dakota, what the actual... Wait, we're changing the conversation. By filming me having sex? I'm not exactly down with that, Dakota. No, 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 Andy. What we're gonna do is, you know, we're gonna take some sexy photos, doll you up, really fix all of this, and then, um, give them to Josh. No, Dakota, absolutely not. We're not doing that. Come on, Andy. Come on, strip. No, Dakota, this is stupid. You know what's stupid, Andy? That you don't even realize that you're the best and any guy would be lucky to hang out with you. Dakota. Who became my only friend in four years? Me. Who cheered me up when I did not have a homecoming date? Me. And who pretended to be my prego girlfriend just to prank my mom? Me. Andy, you are a gorgeous and amazing person, and it sucks you need a guy to validate that. Me. No, no response on that one. All right. Andy, look, the reason I want to take these pictures isn't for someone's spank bank. It's to show you how sexy, independent, and Beyonce you are. Because until you see it, how can you expect anyone else to? Come on, please, Andy, please. Fine. Yes, all right, let's do this. All right, Andy, pose for me, pose for me. Come on now, lick those palms. Where is your milk, Mrs. Kitty Cat? Yes, Andy. Bite the ruler, bite the ruler. Oh, I love it, I love it. Give me some rolls on the bed. Give me some rolls, give me some rolls, give me some rolls. Oh, oh, you're at the beach now, okay. Ooh, you're bad, you're so bad. Come on, spin for me, Andy, spin. Spin like a dreidel, Andy. Uh, oh, wow, you took that literally. Come on, let me help you. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'll admit it. That was actually pretty fun, and I love Smokey the Bear hot in these. But Dakota, you will be burning them. No one can see them. Andy, come on. My camera's digital. Burning it would be impractical. Dakota. <sighs> fine. Fine, fine, fine. Look, they're deleted. See? Well, these you can actually burn. I'll just hold on to these. No, 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 no. These are mine, in case I need to bring these back up and show you what you're capable of. Fine. Even if no one sees these pictures, it made me feel a whole lot better. Oh, Andy, anytime. Where are you going? Hot date? Let me tell you something. Whoever invented Man Kitty is literally the Bill Gates of gays. Alrighty, Dakota's about to go get some. Oh. Sorry. Oh. Sorry, man. Oh, wow. You're harder than you look, Annie Leibowitz. I like that, my man. Thanks, Dakota. Yeah, yeah, that sounds good, man. Wow. Oh. Oh, hey. What's going on in here? What, this? Yeah. Oh, um, it's for a play. Uh, uh huh. The Count of Summer Christo's Dream. Is it like a 70s porn theme kind of deal? Because, wow, nice, nice whip. No, 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 that was, that was a pillow. You sure? I've seen a whip before, and that's that is definitely a whip. Just those are pillows. Um, no, it's the theme's abstract. It's just my interpretation. Okay. Good luck with that. Thanks. I'm just gonna double check here. Are you are you good? Me? Yeah. No. Yeah. I'm fine. Why? I don't know. You brought that guy to school today. You're dressed in kitty stockings, and you know you're. Your room looks like Jenna Jameson's sex lair, so it's just, I feel like that warranted a, you good. Oh, yeah, I, I get that. Totally makes sense. Um, no, I'm fine. Today was just really weird. Courtney had this plan, and play rehearsal ran late. But to answer your question thoroughly, yes, I'm good. I'm great. Josh, is that you? I'm, I'm just finishing. Oh, um, oh, you look great. Yeah. See you later, Andy. Nice. Yo, come in here, man. Woo! 
all right, so not much has changed. Guys are still repelled by me because of Alec, but I can't help but look at the bright side. Josh didn't call me kiddo, and if that can change, who knows what's next? Hey. Hey. Yeah. You seem chipper. Did you get ARs asleep? Crucial. Did you take an upper instead of your PMS pills? I hate that, but I love it. No, I've just been thinking. My brother graduates in a year. And after that, all of the boys of Breyer will get tired of hooking up with the same old sloppy seconds and have no other choice. I'm the last resort cherry on this ice cream sundae. See you later, Sister Zone. <laughs> Don't look at my sister! Well, there's always college. Don't talk to my sister! I'm an animal!